Oh, I don't even have to do anything in this room. Yeah, I like that about games like this where it doesn't have the respawn rate of an old school game. You have to do stuff over for not much reason at all. So it's like the main hub area. What is hitting me? So I need to be aware of stuff like that. Navi's very attent on telling me something up there. It's too bad, I just don't care. Well, I should, because it might be attacking me, I'm not. Is there invisible enemies here? Like, for some reason I'm smelling that sensation in my nostrils. And it's a pretty putrid smell, I must tell you. It's like, it's getting late into the recording too, and I really shouldn't be going onwards, but I did kind of want to do this all in one part. I don't know why I'm getting these. Like, I actively tried to ignore compasses and maps and anything basically at all useless in uh, uh, the other dungeons. But I failed on a few occasions. I got, like, a map or something. But, yeah. The nice part about, like, glitchless, um, like, in, the, in Master Quest, like, you can basically do the exact same thing in Deku Tree, which involves the one skip, which is nice. But then you get to the point where Deku Tree, I mean, the Dazzler's Cavern, is also, uh, that's just the Black Wall. I wish I had this video for this, but I should have known I'd need a squirter, and I'm dumb, so I didn't get a squirter. Yeah, that's, yeah, I got that video for the Nintendo 64, go plug it in, and then I realized I don't have an S video for the, also I should have been on top of that or something. Uh, I have to get the S video for the Elgato attachment, so, now I did that. So, I figured I should have known, like, the damn thing does not input... On my TV, at least, and I don't really have a TV that does this well, and it doesn't input the symbol, the signal. I'm scared. No! Exactly what I didn't want to have happen. Grow bigger and stuff. Like, just do that, and hope I'm in the vicinity. Um, because I probably am not. Oh, there we go. Oh, good. And the second time you get rid of it, it pities you and allows you access onward. So, like I was saying, I got that, and my TV does not handle the old-school signals through an HDMI cable, or just that's how it works. I'm not entirely sure. Um, so I needed to get an S-Video splitter, like I have the splitter for the AV cables, and it's like, gg dude, you could've... ...done the rest of this LP in very high quality, because I'm totally gonna spend like 200 bucks, I, no, it's like 75, but still, it's like the damn thing, kind of expensive, or the RGB mod, which I'd rather just have like a vanilla, no mouse vanilla, not really vanilla, but close to it, that the highest quality I can get out of the N64, and just kind of roam around. I am surprised that I'm not dead. I could make that. Like, I gotta say, the movement for this game is impossible for me to fathom. Also, the reason why I had to do that is impossible for me to fathom. Yes? What's this? Oh. Okay, so she's got something hidden in her shirt, like most girls do. Um, <laughs> the words are just, is that even not, a, is that not a crystal? Like, it looks like a crystal from here, but honestly anything would look like something that would progress me. I don't know how we got three of them to light and... I guess I could run and do that. That sure wasn't. That, like, that's not what I need. Unless it just didn't light up originally. Oh, hey, look at that. It did something different that time. Oh, man. <laughs> I don't have the silly backflip on top of it, but still, like, why didn't I do that before? I just... 
It's like, that's fine. I kind of interest the whole creating platforms gimmick, but the whole you have to play the song again and again, watch the cutscene happen again and again. It's, I'm not really the biggest fan of that aspect of it. Now, why didn't it work like this when I played it on top of this platform? Assuming it's gonna work now, which it did, but I literally did that exact same thing. I guess it just didn't like that I didn't do it legitimately or something. Like, alright, you create a platform- Oh, I I'm such a dumb. I don't know how to do that. Really, yeah, that's... I anticipated it. I would've literally been dead, because it's, it's impossible for this game to give me hearts. So that's how you get over here, although you could do some cool ricochet shenanigans, I would imagine. So I got that door open. Which door even was that? That wasn't a crystal. Good. Well, I'm still gonna leave that in because I thought it was funny, but most likely no one else will. Uh oh. I've already done this wrong. I was running upstairs so that the other one wouldn't hit me like that and I'd break the box, but... Maybe you could just shield drop it. What. The. Hell. God, why? This is so dumb on top of it. No, it's see the other side, so I don't know, maybe it just didn't No, it did. Just in case. All right. Successfully get onto this platform. It's like I didn't even notice that this <laughs> stupid flat like this stupid thing doesn't even stay. Like I don't I don't really understand my gameplay realization skills at no time whatsoever. So yeah, this is a video gonna have to be split into multiple parts, but it's alright because you know I still have that big boulder room anyway. So that's cool, I guess. I don't know. And I got in a downer mood, because I keep having to look stuff up because I'm stupid and just literally not notice things. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. How do I do this without... Um... Yes, well... Yes. Can I just not get really food? It's crazy. There we go. Gonna grow back bars. Oh, that one. Oh, like that. <laughs> Just then. Alright. Oh, that. I can't. I probably that's probably what it does actually. Is that I hit the switch. I guess for a fire maybe I don't remember anymore. It happened more than a millisecond ago. So my key size brain has already removed that information from my computer over here, so I can get rid of you or not. Because as soon as I start pushing this damn block, there's going to be issues. The, the second that I. But that didn't actually happen. I'm sure this rock, this room had rocks in it, the original, but I guess not. This is, it's fucking... Alright, so, what do you think you want me to do here? Let's just hit this, and then the flame stop for like five seconds. Probably gonna get burned since I'm not on the other side of this, so in that case, I'm just gonna... Lots of jerks in this room. And they wouldn't really be jerks in other rooms, but in this room, because I am a child, and fighting with a child. Oh, or that. Did 
Did I get him, or did the light somehow do it? Okay, well, he's back to his old giddy self, so wonderful. Like, I'm just thinking my thoughts aloud. I'm thinking my thoughts, yes. I... I think most people do that, actually. Um, yeah, there's more blocks than I would expect. That shouldn't be too much of an issue. Just get some light on that. gone for good, even though I know the answer to that. In fact, the time it took to get rid of it probably literally just caused more respawn or something. Oh, and that's all you have to do. Okay. I see a billion. I kind of assume a billion, honestly. I don't trust this. I'm scared. Let's get out of this room and on to the uh, final. <laughs> the, can I say the final thing? Darn. Well, come on. Doesn't even make a difference if I jump slash now, because you're probably going to hurt me in some fashion. So I gotta fight an iron knuckle as a child. Now, we all know how difficult these iron knuckle fights are. So, man, I am fearful of my life so much. Actually, I probably shouldn't say that sarcastically. Start this up good. I think the uh, platforms do spawn hard, so that's good. Yes, I've got this handled. Go in, slash a lot of that, and then go for it anyway. Because I sure don't have to play video games really well. Come over here. Come over here. Just lure him to do things. Um, yeah, this is going horribly. Dude, what? Oh, okay. 
shield again as a child. So I want to... Do I have any sticks? No. Well, I'd like to do this and, like, roll in. Roll out. Get wood. And so bad this fight as a child. Holy crap. <laughs> the badness is just coming off of my pores. Dude, I, I don't know how to do this as a child. Like, I thought it was just because I was jump slashing, and maybe now it's because I'm duck slashing, but... It's just not capable for me to avoid this, so if I do this instead, and just get hurt by everything. Sometimes hit me and avoid it. Dumb. No! Oh! Get out of there. Holy crap. Please die. Thank <laughs> you. A lot easier as an adult. <laughs> Not supposed to come in here as an adult, but with uh, hovering strats. That's basically what speedrun becomes if you're not doing glitchless or a run that just doesn't get the gauntlets. Oh boy, didn't you miss this guy? <laughs> like, dude, I want to end the part, you know? <laughs> it's like um, an hour and a half into whatever part this is. My tech skills are the best. Because not only does he flip-flop which one it is, but even if you read Japanese enough to notice that which one is which, they change what the question is. This is... no, this isn't the mirror shield, this is an iron gauntlet. Wait, I'm confused. Never mind, I, I don't know what I'm literally talking about. Oh, here's a cutscene. I'm gonna keep this in because... It's been a very long time since I've seen this cutscene, because, you know, speedrunners never see this cutscene, you just get the, even in 100% you literally just get the better one, and, like, I guess I close this at 100% close this. Like, it's not really a good, positive scene. But, I don't know, it's just something that I've thought about before in the Twin Rover fight while watching, I think it was MST by Joden, who is the war holder for any percent boring RNG runs. <laughs> yeah, that's about it. Yeah, that's... yes, that's enough for me to be playing today. Join me next time as I do the adult section, but probably first finishing up, um the training ground just to break it up a little bit. See everybody.